Hi, I'm going to go through the basics of this camera. This is a big view, very similar. Well, it's the same camera, but just a slightly different name than the one you've got. First thing to check is to see if the actual shutter is opening when you fire the shutter. So turn the camera on by sliding it open. Look down the middle of the shutter here into the lens and press the shutter without the filming. Does it open and close like this? Can you see? It just opens and closes. There you go, very quickly. Occasionally the flash will go when it recharges. There you go. If it works like that, then that's working and is it actually exposing the film with the light through the shutter. If it doesn't open, there's obviously a fault has developed in the camera. So we know the shutter's working. So next step is loading the camera. So put the film roll in this side, put it in there and up into the motor thread there. Take your film tip and then slide. There's a little arrow here where it points. Take the film tip right over into above the arrow. Now you can put a bit extra through there like that. Now it's got to make sure it's flat because there's some, some little sprockets here that push it along. They need to be flat to it. Close the door, keeping it flat, and then push it in. Now, if you click the shutter, what you should do is this number. Not that easy to see on the camera, but we'll try. We'll try and get it in there. Number there should start moving round. And this is moving round now. And it's on three, it's on four, it's on five, it's on six, it's on seven, it's on eight. Can't quite see it on the camera, but is there there's a little number in there and it just rotates round now this camera has also got a rewind button on the bottom here which if you're in mid roll like i am here where i haven't taken the entire roll i can get a pin and just push this and that will rewind the film for me as if i'd finished really if you ran the film to it had finished it would obviously do that automatically and then you can open at the back again and then retrieve the film, which is now complete. I hope that helps. Thanks.